The launch pad is more than just a piece of infrastructure. It's the first contact point between Earth and the cosmos. But what happens when the liftoff doesn't go as planned? In the past, SpaceX faced serious challenges due to launch pad damage. The launch pad, exposed to violent energy during takeoff, is a subject to immense strain. Prolonged use and unexpected events led to cracks, deterioration, and eventually, significant launch delays. Consider the Starship launch from the 20th of April, a momentous day in the history of SpaceX that grabbed headlines worldwide. While the rocket's journey into the sky was undeniably fascinating, there was another story unfolding just as dramatically, right at the base of the rocket. When the Starship's powerful Raptor engines ignited, directing thousands of pounds of thrust downward, the launch pad was the silent barrier, absorbing this incredible force. Following the event, SpaceX teams conducted a thorough inspection and found that the launch pad had suffered significant damage. It was a wake-up call to the extreme forces at work during each launch and a stark reminder of the unglamorous yet crucial role the launch pad plays. SpaceX found itself in a precarious position. Finding a solution was not just important, but critical to keep the pace in the race to space. Musk, the visionary founder of SpaceX, was aware of the gravity of the situation. He and his team set out to find a solution that could weather the storm of a rocket's fiery departure. That's when the idea of steel plates came into the picture, a potential game-changer that promised to bring resilience and durability. But the journey to implementing this revolutionary concept was anything but easy. You might be thinking, what's so exciting about testing a steel plate? But remember, in the context of space exploration, these aren't your average steel plates. They are expected to bear the brunt of extreme conditions during a rocket launch, so understanding their strength and resilience is crucial. Steel plate testing isn't just a simple one-step process. It involves a series of meticulously designed procedures, each focusing on a particular attribute of the steel's resilience. Let's break it down. The first step is tensile strength testing. This measures how much pulling or tension a material can handle before breaking. By assessing tensile strength, engineers can gauge whether the steel can withstand the enormous force exerted by the rocket's downward thrust during a launch. Then, the steel plate is subjected to heat and pressure resistance tests. These simulate the brutal conditions a launch pad faces during a rocket blast-off. Essentially, it's like putting the steel plate in a virtual rocket launch helping determine if it can handle the scorching heat and immense pressure. Here, the steel is continuously stressed and released, replicating the cycles of launch and landing that a SpaceX's launch pad goes through. This stage is all about longevity. It helps engineers estimate the lifespan of these steel plates under realistic conditions. Following each test, experts meticulously pore over the collected data to draw significant conclusions. These results don't just tell us pass or fail. They give valuable insights into the performance of the steel plate under specific conditions, helping to shape decisions about its future use. In the tensile strength test, engineers look for the ultimate tensile strength or the maximum stress that the steel can withstand. This figure is crucial. It tells SpaceX whether the steel plate can endure the intense forces of a rocket launch without failing. The heat and pressure resistance tests results are equally vital. They show how the steel behaves under extreme temperatures and pressures that it would encounter during liftoff. The data from these tests can be used to predict how well the steel plate will protect the launch pad from the fiery exhaust of a rocket. With a deep understanding of the steel plate testing, it's time we turn our lens to a critical aspect that directly interacts with these steel plates. The Raptor engine. This beast of an engine is crucial to the Starship's journey, being its primary source of power and propulsion. The Raptor engine is a pioneering design in the realm of rocketry, being one of the first to use a full-flow staged combustion cycle. This complex configuration ensures better efficiency and performance, enabling the spacecraft to achieve its ambitious missions. Notably, the Raptor engine uses a mix of liquid oxygen and methane as its fuel, a significant departure from the kerosene fuels used in most other rockets. This choice is part of SpaceX's forward-thinking approach, as this fuel can potentially be synthesized on Mars, allowing for refueling for return missions. The steel plates that we've been discussing in this video bear the brunt of this powerful engine during launch. The Raptor's fiery exhaust hits the launch pad with incredible force and heat, making it imperative for the steel plate to hold its ground. 
And now, SpaceX is on the brink of introducing an upgraded version, the Raptor 3. As per Musk's revelations, Raptor 3 promises to bring about enhanced performance and durability while retaining the fundamental principles of its predecessor. It's set to increase the Starship's payload capacity and improve its overall efficiency. The launch pad acts as the literal and metaphorical groundwork for every mission. It's not just a flat surface for rockets to sit on. It's an intricate system with a multitude of functions. It has to be stable and sturdy, capable of withstanding the incredible thrust of the engines during takeoff. It needs to facilitate fueling procedures, safety measures, and of course, withstand the intense heat generated during launch. Now where does the steel plate fit into all of this? As we've seen, steel plates are subjected to rigorous testing to ensure they can endure extreme conditions. This same level of durability is expected of the launch pad, and that's where the steel plates come into play. Steel plates, with their proven resistance to extreme stress, form an integral part of the launch pad structure. By integrating them into the design, SpaceX enhances the durability of the launch pad, allowing it to weather the harsh conditions of repeated launches. This not only ensures safety, but also optimizes cost efficiency by reducing the need for frequent repairs or rebuilds. It's important to know that this is not the first time SpaceX is facing challenges and doubts. From landing reusable rockets to launching the first-ever crewed mission by a private company, SpaceX has time and again proven that the impossible can be made possible. Yet, as they continue to redefine the boundaries of space travel, their sights remain set on a larger prize the colonization of Mars. This audacious goal, once the stuff of science fiction, is closer than ever. That's all for today. But before we sign off, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you enjoyed our video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.